Hey friends, welcome to Vinylize. I'm Jarrett New and today we're gonna to be talking about how to set up your turntable. This is the seventh video in a series that will cover the entire process from start to finish. Feel free to share these videos with all your friends who are just getting into records. In this video specifically, we'll be talking about aligning your cartridge to get the best crystal clear sound possible. If you haven't watched the first six videos, click this card above to start at the beginning. Also, to keep these videos organized, the thumbnail of every video will display their number. That way you can watch them in order. All right, now that we've height adjusted the tone arm, we need to align the cartridge. Now, as you remember, we left the top screws in the center of the head shell holes. Now we're going to adjust them. First, I want you to slightly loosen the top screws with the small screwdriver. This will free up the cartridge just a little bit, allowing us to make fine adjustments. Don't loosen the screws too much, just a little bit will work. Now we need to align the cartridge so that the needle will sit in the groove perfectly and give us the best sound. But how do we align it properly? Well, we're gonna need an alignment protractor. You can buy a basic one on Amazon for about 13 bucks, but there is a better option and it's free. All you have to do is go to the website vinylengine.com, click on tools on the top right, and then click cartridge alignment protractors at the very top. This page has tons of great protractors depending on your specific needs. All you have to do is click on the one that works well with your turntable. In my case, that's the Stevenson Protractor and it will download a high resolution PDF directly to your computer. But the only thing is that you have to sign up on their website in order to download these files. But signing up is completely free as well and it only took me a few minutes. And I didn't need to enter a credit card information or anything like that, so you're good. These printable alignment tools are absolutely perfect for getting your adjustment 100% spot on. All you have to do is poke a hole where the spindle is gonna go and then place the protractor on top of the platter. Now, make sure the cueing device is in the raised position and move the cartridge directly over the first point on the protractor. Now, lower the cueing device and see where the needle lands. Our target is right Right here in the dead center of all of the lines. If you need to, raise the arm, move it slightly, and then lower it again. Keep adjusting the protractor and the arm until you are able to hit the center point with your needle. Okay, now that we've touched down directly on the center point, look at the sides of the cartridge. Are they parallel with the lines on the protractor, or are they a little off? What you want to do is pivot the cartridge until its sides line up with the lines on the protractor. Once the sides of your cartridge are completely parallel to the lines on the protractor, and the needle is resting on the center point, then you're perfect. Now re-tighten the top screws to lock that adjustment into place. Now here is the real test. Raise the arm and move the cartridge from the first point to the second point on the protractor and then lower the arm. Once the needle is on the center point, do the sides of the cartridge still line up? If they do, you're perfect. But if they don't, you're gonna have to go back to the first point and readjust the cartridge. Now, I know this process can be tiring, but you need to keep making fine adjustments until you can hit both points spot on and the sides are perfectly parallel to the lines. I believe in you, you can do this. If you are able to hit both points with the sides being completely parallel to the lines, then tighten the top screws and you are all set my friend. You have now officially aligned your cartridge. Pat yourself on the back, you earned it. But you still need to choose a record mat which can have a huge impact on your sound quality. So click the card above or this annotation to watch the eighth video which will be covering your record mat options. And as always, give this video a thumbs up and hit subscribe. I'm gonna be coming out with a lot of great videos every Thursday and Saturday that you're not gonna wanna miss. Be sure to find me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and more. All the links are in the description below. And most importantly, friends, Keep spinning that vinyl.